The rep does not count. The rep does not count. The rep does not count. Hey there, and welcome back to another video in our series of Saturday shorts on how to fix your bench press. Thus far, we've covered several things. We'll link to them below, but we've covered how to correct your focal point for the bench press. We've covered the correct bar path for the bench. We've covered how to fix your shoulder positioning, how to make sure that they're retracted when you bench. And we've also covered leg drive in the bench press. Today, we're gonna to cover an error related to leg drive in the bench press. Specifically, that error is driving with your legs in such a way that you're not driving up the bench, but instead you're driving your butt up off of the bench. And here's the easy thing to remember. This is a, this is a movement standard, all right? If your butt comes off the bench at any point in the rep, the rep does not count. The rep does not count. The rep does not count. All right, it's like not squatting deep enough. Don't tell somebody you squatted 500 pounds when you only squatted at six inches, it doesn't count. Same thing, this is true in every powerlifting federation, but this should be true in your general training as well. And you can see where this is a problem, right? If your butt keeps coming, you know, once your butt is up off the bench, Where's the end point? Your butt could keep coming further and further and further up off the bench and now your chest is getting further up and further up and further up and you're literally shortening the range of motion on the bench press. So there's gotta be a movement standard. That's the movement standard for the bench press. Make sure that your shoulders, of course, stay on the bench press. I don't know how you're gonna screw that up, but also your butt needs to remain on the bench when you're benching. Be honest with yourself. Don't count the rep if your butt comes off the bench. Hope this helps you get stronger and live better.